What's going on? It's gonna do this quick video to help out a fellow YouTuber. You watch one of my videos with my Kame Magic Clips or Kame 2600s modified to accept the uh, wall blade. We got the wall stagger tooth blade. All right, so these are pretty much just like the magic clips, except the Kame. I did change the lid on this. So first to take off the blade, we got the two screws there at the top. Phillips head screwdriver. Now, Keep pressure. On the top blade so it doesn't fall out. Now I've been using these clippers and I have not cleaned them so I'll do that while it's apart and I'm gonna have to re-zero gap it. So when it comes apart, top blade. bottom blade and the cam follower and the tension spring behind it so now that's how the cam follower and tension spring should look without the two blades off now when doing this mod of course you need the blade cam follower and the spring just as long as you can keep the cost of that under $100, it's worth it. Otherwise, just get a wall magic clip. So, take it apart. This is how the cam follower goes in. This diamond, long diamond shaped, or this shape. This shape faces this way or the back of the clipper. And the tension spring goes right in there. Now I don't know the issue the YouTuber was having. I don't remember his name, but I'm going to put the link in the reply just to show him what it should look like inside. And for assembly, pretty much the same. Get that hair out of there. So if you're wondering, here's the front of the clipper. The spring is there. The U shape is at the bottom. The two prongs go up and the Looks like that face the top of the clipper. Cam follower has those two little indentations where those should go in and the pin on the motor should go in the groove right there. Make sure you keep tension on the cam follower. Usually put my thumb on it, with the top blade, and I slide it on so nothing moves. I just get one hole lined up. After screw. Try to get that tight so nothing comes out. To rotate that, line up your other screw.
tighten that. Not too tight because we're going to have to loosen it up to line it up in zero gap. As you can tell there, the blade is not straight. So, what we got to do is just back off our screws just enough to be able to have it move and not fall out. Truth. Sound test. All right, there you go. Kamei 2600, order me Kamei Magic Clips. Thanks for watching. Hope you helped out. Catch you on the next one.